Yo, what is going on guys? It's Exotic here and today guys, I'll be doing a tutorial video. This is actually one of my first tutorial videos on my channel. Actually, I think it is my first tutorial video on my computer. So just so you guys all know, I did not get my new computer yet. I'm just recording with Camtasia right now because this is actually the only one that works with this computer really well. It just doesn't work with gaming, but it record it like records really well with like, you know, tutorials and stuff. I tested it, bef tested it before this. So anyways guys, this will be how I make my thumbnails because some of you guys out there don't even believe I make my thumbnails. So anyways guys, make sure you guys leave likes about five likes this video and also guys if we can get about 10 likes i will give you guys uh, a link down below to a template so let's just say actually 15 likes i'll give you guys a link down below to a template let's get right into the video what you want to do is go to file new 1280 by 720 transparent and then you want to go to file place this will actually be a call of duty thumbnail though uh you want to get this one i only i got these two things before the video just so i can show you guys how i make it and stuff and then you want to get this bam you can like you can like angle it out wherever. I just you, did it like that on an accident. I didn't mean to do that. So I'm trying to angle it out where you guys can't see the white lines on the side. And there's something right there. Perfect, right there. Perfect. Okay. So now what you guys want to do is you guys want to go to file, place. And by the way, guys, I am using CS6. It's just like it's better. It's worse than CC. But I would use CC if I was you guys. And I still have CC. I just don't want to use it. I like CS6 a little bit better. And then you want to go to perfect. And then you want to turn this off. File place again. Well, you can kind of use, like, any grunge thing. Just search up grunge, like, pictures on Google or whatever, and then it should work. But, well, mine, grunge, yeah, grunge, that's what it's called. And then you want to go to gradient. They're gradient grunges, same thing. I don't know. Actually, it might be. It might not. I don't know. Okay. And then you want to go to this. I'm going to make it purple. Is that, that's probably fine with you guys. And then you want to slide up all this stuff, neat stuff right here. Bam. And then you want to go, bam, right there. On the DSR-50, bring that above the purple one. And I think... Yeah, I think that would be good right there. I'm, yeah, that's good, I guess. I don't know. It's. I think it's good, okay? And then what you want to do is you want to right-click Blending Options, and then you want to go to Stroke, or you can pick Outer Glow. What I'm going to do is I'm probably going to pick Outer Glow. Where is it? Outer Glow. This. Boom. Usually I make it white, sometimes the same color, or a little bit like a darker shade of it. If you. That's what. You, it's up to you guys, but yeah, okay. And then I'm going to put... How to make thumbnails. How to. Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna use that. I'm not gonna use that font. Not, 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 not today. How I make. Oh, you do not wanna do that. Okay, and then you wanna go to Control C. You don't want to make it that exact color how I made it. I just, I don't know why I made it that exact color, that black color. But I'm still going to change the color, obviously. And then you want to go to, you want to bring it up to wherever you like it to be. So It actually looks better sometimes overlapping other things. But what I would do is just do it how you like it because no matter what, it will work. And why does it not let me, wait, what? Okay. Yeah, so right here, and then you could pick this color if you want, like that, bam. You guys can do whatever you guys want, but what I'm going to pick is I'm going to pick like a lighter shade of this color. Bam, bam. But, okay, so you guys might be saying, you guys might think this is kind of stupid, but what I actually do is I open a whole nother layer. I don't know why I do this. I just think it looks a lot better and more clean like this. And then you want to go to this, bam, again. I know it's like you guys might be thinking that's a lot, a big, like, you know, big eraser. So then I want to, then you guys like just want to go over this a lot, like a lot, a lot. And then bam. And then what I do, I throw that down there. And I, I know, I know, it looks kind of bad. But then I want to bring down the opacity a little bit. Just like, perfect, right there, perfect. And then I also make the same thing. Except you guys might be saying, like, why don't you, um, let me see, hold up. Duplicate. Okay. Bam. Drag this down. So anyways, like I was saying, guys, you guys were probably thinking, like, why don't you make the text and press enter, and then, like, it'll br bring you a whole nother layer. The reason why I don't do that is because if you do that, it actually, um, like, it'll bring you a whole nother layer of that text. The reason why I don't do that is because if you do that, it actually doesn't make the thumbnail look as good at all. So then you want to change the size. I'm going to change it to 130, bam, and then you want to type in my thumbnails then you're gonna go bam okay you're gonna go up 
here. Do this. Sorry if I'm not like talking that much, guys. It's kind of like hard to do this at the same time because I don't really make type of cut comms that much anymore. And it is not done yet. I cut. Okay, I'm gonna leak the kid's channel down below in the description. I got the idea from him, and he did not make a thumbnail tutorial. I swear. I just got the idea from him because it looked really good the way he made it, and that's why I used a fire emoji. But you want to go to blending options, and then his name is Zykos. If you guys didn't know. Uh, no, yeah, you guys can do drop shadows, um, stroke, and then you guys do not want to make it a black stroke, you actually want to make it a white stroke, and then you guys want to make it a lot bigger, because, like, it will look t 10 times better if you guys do that, and then you guys want to take this, bam, I'm trying to make it, like, bam, and then that looks really good, actually, uh, if I say so myself, it looks pretty good, and, see, sometimes I do it like this, but I really, like, Showing this, but if I make this any smaller, I mean, I, yeah, I can make that one smaller. Control T. Yeah, see, it wouldn't look good if I made it smaller. This will actually be the thumbnail of this video. So, anyways, guys, I hope you guys all enjoyed the video. If you guys did enjoy the video, make sure to leave like about five likes in the video. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and peace.